What's up folks, Dr. Bo here again. Now that we've been working on that hip flexor stretch, let's see how we can deeper impact our, our hip flexors and open up those hips even more, okay? This is the absolute deepest stretch that you can do. What you wanna do is have some sort of a padding and what we're gonna do is bring our right leg, we're gonna bring it forward and we're gonna create a straight line here and a 90 degree angle in our front leg and then a 90 degree angle in our back leg, okay? This is what we call the 90-90 position, and this is gonna allow us to stretch our hip at the deepest level in the capsule. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get our back nice and straight, and we wanna be looking straight ahead, and from there, we're gonna dive forward as much as we can until you start feeling a stretch. We don't wanna be hunching over like this, but rather keeping the back nice and straight. So for me, as I go here, I start feeling a stretch in my right glute, which is external rotation here, and you may start feeling a little bit of a stretch on the back leg, which is your internal rotation. Typically, your internal rotation is gonna be worse than your external rotation. We're gonna work on both of them here, okay? So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna dive forward as far as I can, and you're gonna get in this position, and once again, you wanna hold these stretches for longer than just 10 to 15 seconds. If you can hold it for about a minute or two, you're really gonna feel a difference in the overall mobility in that hip and also just how tight your muscles are. So I've stretched this out for a little while now and I can feel the glute stretching out, which is awesome. What I'm gonna work on now is the internal rotation on the other side. So lift yourself up, you're gonna rotate so that your left shoulder in this case is gonna be pointing towards your left ankle and I'm gonna reach back and boom, my left hip internal rotation sucks. So this is as far as I can go and you may feel a little bit of a pinching in that left hip. All that you're gonna do is you're gonna hold tight here and continue holding this position and you can pull yourself in deeper as well. Once again, hold this for a minute or two and what you can do is flip swat sides as well where now we're gonna go ahead and get the left leg in the front, bring the right leg back, create a 90 degree angle here, 90 degree angle here, which is very important and now I work on my external rotation on this side, I dive forward and then I bring it back after holding it for a minute too, and I go back and my right hip is even worse than my left. So folks, try practicing this on a daily basis, especially when you get home from work. Make sure you do the hip flexor stretch throughout the day, and there are ways that you can step this up as well, but let's start off with this very basic level, and just by doing these two stretches on a daily basis, you're gonna feel your hips open up a lot more. Thank you.